a boat is required to fish effectively for bull trout on Lake Billy Chinook. This deep canyon reservoir west of Madras covers 4,000 acres, has over 70 miles of shoreline, is 400 feet deep in places, and the fish move constantly. You know, fishing for these bull trout, you have to be willing to try a lot of different techniques. Um, typically, when I do this, I'll fish three or four methods before something works. And a lot of it has to do with just the, the activity level of the fish. Our first tactic is fishing with herring on salmon mooching rigs 90 feet deep with three ounce banana weights. And I'll set on a clicker so that in case a fish hits it when I'm not watching, we'll hear that. The clicker never buzzed after an hour of slow trolling with herring, so it's time to move and try another technique. And the second technique we're using to try to catch bull trout today is fly casting with streamers because their prey is uh, kokanee, which are fast fish and never stop moving. So when you're fly fishing for bull trout, you are casting and retrieving constantly. Another hour of casting and stripping a streamer and no bites, it's time for another method. Diving crankbaits. These have a little bill on them, so when you retrieve them or pull them through the water, they go down. This one's rated to go down about nine feet. And right in this area, the water's about nine feet deep. There has to be a whole school of them, right? Come on, Forrest, use your <laughs> cameraman mojo on these fish. <laughs> We're rolling, man. <laughs> no pressure. No pressure. <laughs> right over here. Over your shoulder. Good luck. Throw behind the camera, guys. See what happens over there. That'd be a good angle for me yeah, right here. Be. <laughs> I got some more oh, There's a fish right here on camera. This is a good one. <laughs> Woo! That's a good size one. Come on, fish. I mean, I'm just holding on <laughs> for all I can hold on. We're gonna show you to the world. He's trying to hit the motor. That's a good size one. Take a look at that. That's about a, oh, that's about a 20, 19 or 20 inch fish. And that's probably a three pounder, conservatively. It's a pretty good sized fish. <laughs> you can see why they call them bull trout. Look at the size of the head on those things. I mean, it's just a big, fat head. How about like this? That's a nice fish. OK. Big ball. Nice fish. Hello. Yeah. Oh, oh. I'm going to put it back. Uh -huh. And releasing, you know, make sure they're swimming well, and off they go. The limit on bull trout in Lake Billy Chinook is one per person, and the fish must be over 24 inches long. Anything under that size should be released unharmed. A Warm Springs tribal permit is required to fish on the Metolius arm of Lake Billy Chinook. That's in addition to an Oregon fishing license. There's one. Oh, it came off. Oh, that felt like a big fish. Fishing for bull trout typically peaks in April before the shallows get too warm and the big trout head for the cooler depths. From Lake Billy Chinook, I'm Brooks Navely for The Great Outdoors.